Hello, hello, everybody. I'm super excited. Very excited, kind of hyper. So, apologize in advance for the crazies. Because when I get hyper, I act like a kid. But this box is very much exciting me right now. And it's been building. I got it first thing this morning. and But I had my niece's birthday party um, that we were at. And then I had errands to run, orders to ship out, and all sorts of that fun stuff. So I have been busy all day. Anyways, so it's 3 o'clock now. And I just got home and kind of fi finished the little things I was working on. And then I was like, I have to do this unboxing. Um, I have all of my nieces and nephews are here tonight. So there's six of them coming over at five. And I'm like, I need to do it now. Otherwise, it might just not get done. Um, and then I have my live tonight too. So we're doing this, guys. We are doing it. And we're doing it right. I am a huge Diamond Art Club fan. As you all know, oh my gosh. Has anyone seen the new tree that they came out with this morning? If you saw it, did you order it? Because I have a feeling that one is going to be sold out. Um, it has glow in the dark in it. It has specialty drills. It is just, it's gonna be amazing. Um, if you aren't a Diamond or Ruby member, then it will not be available till you, the to you until Monday. But if you're interested in seeing what it looks like, Miss Coffee, Miss uh, Crafting with Miss Crochet and Coffee did do um, an unboxing of it yesterday and it is so worth it, so worth it. So if you haven't seen that unboxing, guys, go to her channel um, and watch it because you will be waiting Monday morning for that to come to you because it is that awesome. Um, this one I'm very excited about. So, I only got one this week and I had a really hard time desi deciding what was going to be like at the top of my list. Um, because they came out with so many beautiful canvases last week. They really, really did. Um, and then that tricky, tricky one that they put de down there that was the postponed, that was like, it came out and it was sold out. I'm like, how is it sold out when it just literally just like came out? But then it said it was postponed for November. Um, that one is gonna be gorgeous. But all of them, they were really, really cool this week. I really, really liked them. The Nova was really cool. Um, this one was cool. The mermaid one. Um, yeah, I am guessing because if you watch me very often, you have probably kind of learned my style, um, and the ones that I like. And so if, if that's the case, um, you probably know which one that this is, this is that I have here in my hot little hands. If this is your first uh, video, um, you've watched of mine, um, unboxing or otherwise, welcome first off um and second off you might not know what it is but i am so so excited you guys oh my gosh i'm excited okay i have here just in case you know my my diamond my diamond art club inhalers which i've got a lot of them now so we won't have any problems with that but we are going to open this and we are going to get in it and we're going to hear all the freaking out because ugh, this is going to be one of those I don't want to put away. I don't want to put it away. Ugh. Okay, so there is the canvas. Love how they are putting um, this on the outside. And love how the sticker is now in the box, not rolled up in there. Now... I loved how they did that because it's not like super rolled tight. So like when you're trying to take the stickers off and it's, it's just, or it's just annoying. But the other thing is, is that now that it's like, not like this, they are not going to be rolled so tight. So the stickers, if you do what I do and cut them up, then, um, so if you cut these all up and put them on your whatever you use for storage, which is what I do, they will not try to peel up because they're not curved. So um, I can't remember who said that, but it's true. Um, and I do use them for my 
uh, Harbor Freight thing. So this is a round tool kit. If you are new to Diamond Art Club, difference between a round tool kit and a square tool kit is the square tool kits have uh, tweezers, not scissors. Why do you need scissors? What's up with my brain? They have tweezers in the square. So because we have a round, that means this is a round, um, which I'm happy about. I like square and round actually, but there are certain ones that I, I think would be, I don't know, that I would prefer it to be round and then there are certain ones I'd prefer to be square. I actually would prefer this one to be round, so I'm glad that that is the case. If you are also new to Diamond Art Club, in this little kit has a tray for you, a clear tray, boat with the funnel, two um, heart waxes, a pen, a little squishy to make that pen a little bit more comfortable. Um, some baggies and this one came with a six placer. So some come with a multi-placer, some do not. But I am not gonna open that because this is what I wanna get into. We will look at these in a minute. So, okay, this is new, but I showed it to you already, can't remember which video. But if you want to see this new instruction booklet, I will link that video below because I did go through it and show you guys the new, you know, instructions that they have now. But I'm not going to do that every time because boring. Okay, I'm going to roll this backwards so that we can get a good look at it. I'm not going to look at it till I flip it down on my table. I'm probably going to have to have it sideways because this one is um, bigger than the last few that I've got. Okay, hold on. Okay, there, it's that way. Now I'm gonna roll it this way just a little bit up so that this side doesn't um, curl. I got. I can't show you while I'm rolling it because I don't want y'all to know until you see it. Okay guys, are you ready for this? I don't think you are. Oh my word. Oh my word, I wish my camera would go a little bit higher. Let me see if I can get it even a little bit. That's like as high as it wants to go. High as I can get it. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh my gosh, look at that face. Okay, this is gorgeous, but look at that face. Look how big it is. Oh my word, you guys. Look how big this dragon's face is or seahorse or whatever the heck it is because I think she's like a mermaid is what she looks like um and so maybe this is I don't know I thought it was a dragon because of the way it looks but it could possibly be like a seahorse or something I don't know no it looks like a dragon I don't know I don't know guys now I'm kind of confused because it is definitely, she is definitely a mermaid. Um, but it has like these dragon scales. So it could be like a seahorse. Because I would assume that might be what they look like. I don't know. Whatever. I don't care what it is. Maybe it's a sea dragon. We're going to go like this. I want to just see how big this sucker's face is. His face is 40 centimeters. Yes, please. So it's like 20 by 40, just his face. And his face is, his name is Jet. This one's name is Sasha and Jet. It is a 55 by 77 centimeters. So it is one of the bigger ones, that's for sure. But oh my gosh. Oh my word, this one is so beautiful. I don't even have words. I really don't. I'm just like in total awe of how cute and beautiful Jet is. And then Sasha, my gosh, she's a beauty. Let me move that away from her beautiful eyes. Her eye makeup is absolutely stunning. I love her eyelashes. Like that's one thing that I really, really like about um, Hannah Lynn's artwork is the eyelashes, the eyes, the faces in general. I just go completely mushy over because they're so pretty. Um, and the hair. She does such a phenomenal job of the hair. I look at this hair. Oh my word. Yeah. I don't know how you could not like this. I mean, I know everybody has different tastes and that's 
totally normal and okay but how could you not like this piece like really how could you not like it i don't care who you are if you don't like this piece something wrong with you and then her body down here and into like the mermaid tail like the mermaid is absolutely like her tail is gorgeous i love these colors of her tail they are absolutely beautiful oh my word she's just stunning i love the top her like bra piece with the necklace and everything it is so pretty and you guys this one does have some confetti like in the hair but it is as miss coffee says like respectful respectful confetti it's not horrible like yeah it's confetti but it's not like little bits here and there they're they're still in chunks together um it's not like a single and a single and a single you know what i'm saying so it does have a lot of color blocking in a lot of it like her face is a lot of color blocking her body is color blocking um so it's it's pretty much i would say split down the middle between some confetti and color blocking but yeah that confetti it's not bad it's really not that bad um as always their canvases are like gorgeous they're so sparkly already even before you put the drills on them and then of course i mean come on I have not one time got a diamond art club that wasn't super sticky, but for those new people that might maybe have never seen a diamond art club before, then I want to show you all that. So the other thing is that I'm going to say again, and I cannot emphasize this enough because I've had lots of comments, messages about this asking me, um, there is divots and stuff in the plastic. There's wrinkles and all that. I'm bringing you down. I'm going to bring you down. I'm gonna bring you down, down, down. Okay. Um, so if you can see like this line right here in the plastic, that is not a river. It, it's not, I promise you. It is just the, the plastic, the way it's kind of pulled up when they rolled it. And even though on the actual canvas itself, when you pull that plastic up, sometimes and i don't think you can really see it on camera especially because i don't have like the best camera but there there seems to be like little indentations in the canvas um but again it is purely cosmetic it will not affect how your drills are put on the canvas it doesn't affect if they stick or not it doesn't affect anything so if you like are getting your first diamond art club because that's the people i'm, I'm getting the questions from are the people who are like getting their first one um, and kind of panicking about that. I promise you it is purely cosmetic. It will not affect anything. So just forget about it. Don't worry about it. Um, don't pay any attention to those um, what seems to be like a river because it's not a river. It's just the plastic. It's because it is poor glue method. So, I mean, I can't say it's impossible because nothing's impossible, but I have never seen a river, a bubble, or anything like that on pour glue um, method. So, that's more what you have to worry about when you're using the um, double-sided adhesive when you have the opaque cover down. If it's a clear cover, it should be pour glue. There is one other kind of glue. I can't remember what it's called, um, but yeah. So, don't, don't worry about that. Um, wow. I could just sit, I could literally put this on my wall like it is and just be happy. Obviously I won't because it's gonna be even more gorgeous once the drills are on it and it's like, boom, vibrant. Cause yeah, those like, the colors are so vibrant and Diamond Art Club drills, there's nothing like them. There just isn't. Okay, so there are 37 colors on this one. Like I said, this one is Sasha and Jet. And it's a 55 by 77 centimeter. I'm not sure inch wise, like, because they are going to fit, um, they're changing like all of their canvases to fit standard frame sizing. So I'm not sure what inches this is, but let's find out, shall we? Shall we? Okay, hold on, hold up. Come on, work for me, please. So this is a little over 30 inches, just like, a just a hair a little bit of a hair over that and let's go this way okay so and then this way it is 21 and a half so 21 and a half 
21 and a half. I already forgot how long this was. <laughs> See how my brain works? 21 and a half by a hair over 30 inches. So that is your frame size. Um, but yeah, actually I think I have one that's gonna fit this frame. I mean, I have a frame that's gonna fit this piece. <laughs> yeah, I make sense. Okay, first off, how many ABs are in here? Are there ABs in here? There are ABs in here. There are two ABs in here. Those ABs are 137 and 138. It's a blue, and I believe the other one is like the purplish blue. The symbols are the three little like weird triangle looking things and E. So where are those at? Let's look. So let me see. What is this thing right here? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta look up at my camera so that it shows better. Okay, so right in this like triangle, I mean triangle, yeah, it's kind of, nah, it's like an upside down tear right here. It's kind of where her hair wouldn't be. Um, there are quite, is that where it is? No, 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 right here, right here in her hair actually. So there is ABs through her hair, lots of them actually, both colors of ABs are through her hair. What about the dragon? Are there ABs on the dragon? I am looking, 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 looking. Um, I don't see any ABs on the dragon. Does that mean there isn't any? Absolutely not. Just means that my eyes aren't seeing them. Um, doesn't mean they're not there, because I bet you there are some sprinkled in there. It's like, oh, there are. So, and they are. They're just kind of sprinkled. Like if you took some cupcake sprinkles and just do, 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 do. That's kind of what the ABs are. They're literally just sprinkled in. These little, these little, you can't even see what I'm doing. You can't even see me. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Let's look at Jet's face. So Jet's face has these sprinkles right here. All those little sprinkles are ABs. They're going to be beautiful. And of course, there are quite a bit of ABs through her tail, which of course makes the scales really, really beautiful. There's going to be a lot of 310s in this one, y'all. Yes, there is. Man, that, their eyes, she does, Hannah Lynn does an amazing job with her eyes, doesn't she? All right, we're going to look at the drips. We gonna look at the drills. Here they be. Here they be. Let's open them up. Well, not open, open them, but you know, you know what I meant. Ah, oh, there's like a broken. I don't know. It's not even a drill. It's like a piece of plastic. Weird. Okay. How many blacks do we have? One, two, three, four. That's it. There's gotta be more. There isn't, though, guys. Oh, here they are. Here we go. So there are eight full bags of three tens, and then on this one is a set of eight twenty. So we're gonna put those three tens to the side and start out over here. So we've got all these three tens here. Then we got five ninety seven, nine fifty one, nine fifty one, three eighteen, thirty seven sixty, four fourteen. 796, 519, 353, 3824, 3341. Ah, ABs, ABs, we have some ABs. These are one of my favorite, these are like, I have to say 137 is probably my favorite ABs. I would have to, I would have to say. I would have to, I'd have to guys. Look at how pretty those are. Yes, yes, they're beautiful, beautiful. Okay, $37.99, $413.33.71, and last but not least on this row is $38.11. I really, really have um, come to like this color. It is a very, very pretty light, light teal color, and I really like it. It's beautiful, I love working with it. Um, I think it looks great on the canvas. All right, now we go to our next one. And they are 415 babies. 138, 
138. These are my other like favorites. They're so pretty. The blues, man, the blue ABs, they're just something else, aren't they? Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. 3861, 3843, one of my favorites. 333, 775, 700, 3865, 803, 208, 702, 209, 912, 600, 3853, 600 is one of my favorites too. Isn't that beautiful? It's like a fuchsia, like a dark fuchsia. 3853. Light, light gray, 762, 907, 720, another one of my favorite colors, pink, 602, and 977. So, those are the drills. That is the canvas. This one is gorgeous. I want to work on it now, but I will have to use some restraint because I have to remember Christmas. Yes, I know Christmas is only two months, guys. Two months and Christmas is here. That is not a lot of time. It is going to go like that. I have been super busy with my Etsy store, so I have to make sure that when I am using my time to diamond paint, I have to do those canvases I have set out for gifts so that I can get them done. After Christmas, all bets are off. Because I'm going to be working on any one that I want to work on. And there are a list of them that I probably won't be able to choose. And so I'm going to make you guys choose because I can't. I mean, how can you choose between some of these? I mean, really. Some of the Mandy Manzanos that are still really standing out to me that I really would like to do. The Hannah Lynn's. Um, this one, the Ice Princess. Those ones are like really, really in Willow. Like... I mean, I just want to do them all, but I probably will wait on, um, um, Muhu because I have seen it done, and so I know what it's going to look like, not maybe in person, but I do know what it's going to look like, like, on screen and everything, and as much as I love that one, there are other Hannah Lynn's that speak to me more, like this one. This one, um, is, it's just stunning. It really is, you guys. The the uh, dragon, seahorse, whatever the heck it is, is beautiful. And I love it. Love it! Okay. That is all I have for you right now. But don't forget, tonight, 6 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. So that is a little, that's two and a half hours. I go live. So if you would like to join me, um, in my live tonight, I would absolutely love to have you. My nieces and nephews will be here, um, but that's okay. We will, we'll still hammer through. Also during my live, I do show some of the like newer inventory that I've gotten this week for you, um, to see for my Etsy store. And that way you guys get kind of get firsthand at the stuff that's going to be in the shop. Either it will be in the shop today or it will be by tomorrow. So you'll kind of get firsthand at that. Um, and yeah, so with that being said, as always, you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. So with that, keep shining, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys! Thank you for watching, and if you haven't already and would like to subscribe, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and the bell icon to be notified when I put up a new video.